Morning, good evening, and good afternoon, Abyssinian Missionary Baptist Church. This is Reverend Frank, and these are your ABC announcements. So, everybody stop for a minute, take a moment, breathe, listen to the announcements, take a break in whatever it is you're doing, and as, even as you're watching this video, let me know that you're watching me do this video by tagging yourself in the comments. So, we're going to start it off like this. Everyone should be receiving the e-newsletter from Pastor Earl. Be sure, now be sure, review your vision and mission statements as well as the strategic plan. Uh, we have all of that information in the newsletter. So if you're not signed up for the newsletter, uh, just reach out to us at abcministries1 at gmail.com and we can get you on that mailing list so you stay informed and knowledgeable about what's going on with Abyssinian in and around Abyssinian. All right, next we are on a, we are in the middle of an epic sermon series called Discipline Discipleship. It is part of our pastoral preaching direction uh, called Empowerment Through Physical Wholeness. So you know since the beginning of the year, we've been on a fasting. We've been making, um, uh, making it a point for us to do exercise and work out and eat better uh, because not only are we trying to do what's right spiritually, but we're also trying to keep our bodies healthy. And with that being said, salute to everyone that has sustained during the entire fast. I mean, y'all some No Limit Soldiers, so we trust that it led to a deep for clarity and conviction on your walk with God. Uh, and we look forward to seeing how these gifts and all of that will guide us uh, forward in the series. And as a matter of fact, I'm just going to tell y'all this. I heard that Pastor Earl is going to be preaching a sermon this week called, You Need a Nap. Now, how many of us need a nap? Y'all remember back in the day when we actually hated taking naps, and now we'll probably get out here and fight somebody just to get like a five-minute nap in. So you already know it's going to be off the chain when we hear this sermon because the last three weeks have been off the chain already. So 2022 is coming on in swinging, and Pastor Earl is swinging hard for us. All right, and speaking of that, I said in the first announcement that you should review your vision and mission statement, right? Well, we are asking you to do that because we want each and every one of you to record yourselves uh, speak, speaking or saying our vision and mission statement so we can feature you one Sunday. Uh, it is important for us to display the wide range of blackness that we have here at the Blackest Church in Memphis and Shelby County. So don't be shy. If you don't know how to record yourself, just reach out, uh, again, abcministries1 at gmail.com, and Lady Denise will set up a time for you so you can record your vision and mission statements on Zoom. We can do that. Are we good? We got a deal? All right. If we got a deal on that, hit me up in the comments. All right. Next, mark your calendars because the last weekend of this month, we will be having our church leadership training. That's going to be on January the 29th at 10 a.m., that will be followed right away by our community stakeholders meeting at 12 p.m. Both of these um, trainings and both of these meetings will be virtual because, you know, we are still in the midst of a pandemic. Uh, we got all the variants from A to Z in the Greek letters coming up. I think they finna even switch over to some other stuff because it's so many variants coming out. So we are still trying to maintain and make sure that our members are safe and healthy. Also, that next day, which is January the 30th, we will hold our annual church business meeting at 12 p.m. Uh, so this will give us a chance to discuss more collectively how our strategic plan is fueling our opportunities for increased resources and employment. And on that note, right now, ABC Ministries, our, our church is going to be partnering with the University of Memphis and a few other local organizations to help those who qualify for temporary assistance for Needy Family Program. Uh, the job actually launched this week, and we want to thank all of the Abyssinians who have answered the call and have allowed us to advance our vision and mission uh, to be a congregational network that can actualize the gainful employment and contractual work of our own people. Uh, keep your eyes open because we will be having other opportunities for this and we are looking to pull people from our actual congregation. All right. Don't miss our Bible study on the first and third Wednesdays. 
That's with Reverend Frank. That's me. <laughs> we had an awesome discussion in Bible study this past Wednesday. So look for the next Bible study to actually come up on the first Wednesday of February. I'm asking that everyone get a copy of Obrey Hendricks. Uh, I can't say his last name like that, so forgive me. But Obrey Hendricks' book called The Politics of Jesus. Uh, and once you get it, go on and read that very first chapter. Uh, we will be using that uh, as kind of like a study guide to bounce off what we're actually reading because we're talking about Moses first and foremost. Uh, so we're going to be using that going back and forth uh, because it has a lot of good information. It dissects terms that we commonly know about. So let's get ready for that next Bible study, which will be the first Wednesday in February. All right. Reverend Tamika is hosting monthly service projects for ABC. Um, if you need to come in like that or connect with ABC that way, please reach out to Reverend Tamika. Uh, that's my home. That's my ace. Uh, South Memphis native. Uh, hit her up at TamikaGreer at gmail.com. That's T-A-M-E-K-A-D-G-R-E-E-R -E -E at gmail.com. On the second and fourth Saturday of each month, Pastor Josh, yeah, that Negro, uh, he'll be hosting uh, some meetings at Muggin. Uh, he has a name here. I don't want to say it. I think it's uh, Mimbungi. Uh, that might be wrong, but I didn't want to embarrass myself like that. But he'll be holding these meetings at uh, Muggin Coffee House in Whitehaven. Again, that's the second and fourth Saturday of every month. Uh, reach out to Pastor Josh if you're interested. That's at JD Harper Ministry at Hotmail.com. Yeah, that man still got a Hotmail address, but I'm going to let him slide on that. <laughs> I know you're going to be talking crazy in them notes on them comments on Saturday. So each Sunday after service, someone from the leadership team is going to host a Black Talk, Back Talk session. Uh, I participated last weekend. Uh, this is a good chance for you to get together to kind of talk about the sermon. Um, <clears throat> it's also being used to kind of push the way our sermons are going to go uh, because what we're doing in these discussions is we're talking about what we thought uh, landed or what, what was good uh, some of the controversies that we ran into or some of the things that kind of uh, didn't rub us right. So this is your chance to kind of give your input on how Abyssinian service, services should go. So it's only a few minutes. I think we were on there for maybe about 15, 20 minutes at the most. Uh, so let's just log into that right after. And I mean, it's immediately after the service. So you don't have to go, uh, you know, you don't have to wait or anything like that. So uh, whatever you, your thoughts were on the sermon, you have a chance to give some feedback on that. All right. Now that is all the announcements that I have. Uh, let's continue to stay prayerful. Let's continue to keep up what's going on with it at, at Abyssinian Missionary Baptist Church. And I love each and every one of you with the love of God. Until Sunday, take care.